Good morning and welcome. It's Jilly Cube and I'm here in Queensland, Australia. I'm doing a pour, an acrylic pour today on this lovely round 16 inch canvas and I'm actually, you know, going back to basics. I think it's, you know, one of the basic um, acrylic pours I ever did was the, f the dirty cup flip pour, flip cup pour. So it's just basically a technique in that you're loading your colours into your cup on top of each other like that and you literally will just flip your cup so i'm starting with just lovely caramel colors um so in there was white champagne gold metallic bronze and then i will keep layering my colors and i think the only difference will be from the lovely caramels i may add a blue so see how we go but this is a very basic easy pour especially if you're a beginner but it also gets fantastic results end results and always different never the same so um, and they always are sellable pieces of art or certainly lovely to put up in your home or to gift so let's get on our merry way So there we go, a fully loaded cup with those lovely yummy colours. Can't wait to see the effects that this one brings out. So it's literally, yeah, you've loaded your colours up in the cup and then the big deal is flipping your cup without throwing your paint over the room. You can certainly bring your canvas up on top of your cup and turn it over, but... Um, got a little bit more used to doing this now already loving those colors on canvas so the lovely surprising bit of this particular kind of technique is you never know what you're going to get and all sorts of things can effects can pop up in there and it's usually a just a beautiful um, pleasure giving to actually create it kind of pull so let's see what we get in this one just gently tilting at first around that round canvas just to let the paint touch basically every area in it before I start to tilt the paints off over the side of the canvas.
Why we, why we? What a stunning, stunning effect. Those colours, I just absolutely love them. They're beautiful. Um, it just looks, yeah, like another world. It looks like another world. Um, really lovely effect. Look at those kind of giant cells I have on the right, but not too many cells overtaking the piece itself. It um, certainly is a lovely one. I'm super duper happy with this. What do you guys think? I'm just whizzing over at the minute with my heat wand. The heat wand doesn't blow any paint about. It just literally bursts air bubbles in there. Super duper happy with this. And I will show you photos of this piece. But a confession. I just push on a little bit further. You may be sad with what I do, but you remember your art, your rules, your way. So here I go. I have to push the boundaries, don't I? It's just going to use two colours, I think. So that's a little bit of the black. Oh, there you go. I'm only using the one colour because it's got all those yummy colours already on there. I'm just doing two little embellishments. I know that you probably won't agree it needed anything at all. I had to jillify it. I love doing, pushing on. Um, remember it's your art, your rules, your way. So that one's not too good, but I'll finish the embellishment on it. And I'm loving the way it did end up. So bear with me, people. Like I say, if you were doing this, you don't have to do what I do. I just give you ideas for you to take the things you like to do in your own art room or the things you don't, you can leave out. It's just giving you ideas when some people do get stuck with what to do. So somebody might just want to do those um, blowouts all over it. But I just liked it, those two little ones in that one end. And I will embellish it further with the balloon, of course, to bring out some nicer effects in those blown out um, botanical effects. But I really do love the colours and I love the technique of the um, flip cup. So I'm hoping you like it too. But like I said, you just take from it what ideas it may provoke in your head. So that's my bit for today people well i hope um, you enjoyed it and you will be back tomorrow for more so have a look at the photos at the end some were with with and some without the embellishment um but certainly enjoyed creating this and i just love my life <laughs>